Welcome to The Succulent Home with me, Melissa. Today, you guys, I'm going to be trimming, beheading some aeoniums and these chocolate fingers, um, known as the cotyledon um, succulent. It has um, this very plum, um, purple, almost like a chocolate color, if you will. I'm beheading it. They're usually low to the ground when they grow, but these have gotten really leggy. I believe it's because these pots are too shallow for it, um, but it's a full sun succulent, also can take light shade. It does flower best um, in full sun. The water needs are very low. It's just like the Aeolium. They're very drought tolerant. But the Aeoniums, they do go dormant during summer. Um, their growing um, seasons is usually for these chocolate fingers during um, spring and summer because they do bloom. Um, they usually bloom in orangey tangerine color. They also, um, like the Aeonium, don't require much. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm cutting all of these, I'm beheading them because I don't want these aeoniums anymore in this pot either. I'm cleaning them up, taking the dry leaves off and cutting them as close to the head of the aeonium as possible. I'm gonna go ahead and just let them dry out too. I'm not going to worry about watering them because they do need to callus over and like I said earlier, these are um, dormant during these summer months, so I'm not gonna worry about um, watering them right away because um, they're not gonna produce any new growth, if you will, anytime soon. Also, I'm trying to be careful with these um, chocolate fingers because they do have that powdery substance, that waxy protective leaf coating, um, so that they don't get sunburned. So if you're wondering um, what is that powdery substance, for those of you who do not know, it's just nature's way of protecting them from getting sunburned. So although they can handle full sun, that's the reason why. But for these, I'm gonna keep underneath the pergola. So when I repot them in a bigger pot, I'm gonna keep them shaded, if you will. So um, these are pretty hardy, so I am not too delicate. The leaves don't fall off of these very easy, but um, I'm just trying to cut them as quick as possible. Sorry about my elbow and my hat. They always seem to get in the way. Now here they are. I put them in this bigger pot. They um, are gonna have plenty of room to grow a lot of deep roots going down. I'm gonna see how long they can be compact where I don't have to transplant them anywhere else. I'm gonna keep them in this pot. I sprinkled cinnamon all on top of the soil to help um, the, the fresh cutting to get calloused as quick as they can. Now, when you see a pot around the house with succulents, whether they're aeoniums or these chocolate fingers, and they're looking a little deprived or old, don't worry about it. Hey, note to self, just like us, there's beauty when you clean it up. So go ahead, just like these aeoniums, maybe you're needing a uh, a fresh new haircut, or maybe you need a new outfit for summer. Go ahead and treat yourself. Just like these aeoniums, we're not disposable. There's still life in them. So as we age, as we get older, don't get upset. Don't avoid looking in the mirror. Look at yourself. Tell yourself that you're beautiful and that you're only getting wiser with age. And every new year that passes, you're that much more ahead of the game. So Enjoy today, enjoy the little things, and appreciate not just your succulents, but appreciate the woman or the man that's looking back at you in the mirror. Because hey, you got something to offer this world, and it's you. Well, until the next video, God bless. Bye.